you see those singles uh, try your ball weight shot yesterday? And I did. I wasn't very impressed only because <laughs> he's seven, what, three? <laughs> he got a longer wingspan, so my shot's always farther no matter <laughs> where the release point is, right? Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> he said he made it on his first attempt. That's impressive. That's pretty good. What have you seen from him as a rookie? Do you watch any film on Porzingis? Um, not individually. I just watch their games and stuff. But he's got all the you know, attributes you would really, really want. Um, and his games, from what I've seen, developed you know nicely over the course of the year. It seems like he's getting more comfortable and more aggressive, so figuring out you know, the system and how, how he's going to be you know, uh, effective and on this level. And he presents a problem, obviously, with his height and his presence on the floor, so you, you know, got to try to make him work as much as you can early, not let him get you know, position and get to where he wants to go, try to make him more comfortable. You think about these potential matchups for you tonight and Carmelo and Porzingis? I'm excited. I got a chance to play against uh, Porzingis the summer league. So I was obviously able to see him before he kind of blew up and you know became the player that you know I personally feel like that he was going to be. Um, at the end of the day, I think he's going to be a great player. Obviously, we know what we're going to get from Carmelo. So for myself, just trying to be ready and just like every other guy on the bench. And, you know, like I said, it's been a long season, so obviously some of the guys are maybe a little more tired, so just try to be able to bring energy whether I'm on the floor or on the bench.